Hey guys, thanks for watching my uh, overview of my Lego Power Station that I put together here. You see I'm starting off with a uh, far out zoom of it and then we'll uh, zoom in in a minute so I can show you all the little details. If you notice, about 66% of it is uh, two of the different uh, Lego Batman movie sets and then uh, some pieces in the middle on the end are uh, creations I took just from looking at power plants near my house. So I'm going to zoom in here first off uh, on the left hand side you'll see I use the uh, Scarecrow Pizza Delivery. I use that little guard shack there, got the uh, security guard guy right there in the uh, window. Uh, you can see him right there. Then I just flip-flopped uh, which direction the railing uh, went. It was uh, facing going out, so I turned it so that it was facing going in. And I used uh, that whole little uh, guardhouse entryway there. Obviously I didn't use Scarecrow or the Pizza Delivery because that doesn't fit in my town but I used that piece there. Then uh, before I show you what I actually did, uh, the middle piece here where you see the other worker is the uh, little power plant uh, set up from uh, Batman and Mr. Freeze, also one of the uh, Lego Batman uh, movie sets. So the only difference that I did is I put the roof on it and then I put the light uh, right there on the uh, right hand side uh, closest to the camera and then the yellow uh, smooth uh, tile uh, up front there. Now based on uh, some stuff I saw by my house you know those two kind of look good together because I know uh, three of the sets and the Joker balloon escape were all supposed to go together but it kind of just really didn't fit in how I wanted my town. So you notice what I did here and I'll start up uh, top zoom in right there so you can see it is I used some of the uh, technique uh, bricks I used some of the uh, coils and then a uh, holder there I uh, used uh, 1 by uh, 12s up top and then a uh, 1 by 4 uh, I guess you could say modified tile uh, in between there and then I stacked them up on top of each other. I used the, uh, a hose to go across to count as a wire to connect my two uh, utility poles and then I have the coils underneath again uh, connected by a connector to uh, hold them underneath so it looked like it was uh, the electrical uh, coils that you'll see on a power line. Then uh, the base is a uh, one by one by five. I've got two of them together. And then I actually uh, used ones that had the uh, hollowed uh, center because I wanted to make sure that uh, I could connect the uh, underneath of the uh, one by four uh, modified tile uh, that I was talking about a second ago here. I want to make sure I could uh, center it right on the pole. Then in the back here, I used just a couple uh, random cylinders I found on BrickLink. And then just a couple uh, random technique pieces. Uh, put a gray hose together, kind of made it look like, you know, it was uh, the generators, uh, backup generators in case the uh, city uh, ever uh, lost electricity. I used the uh, security guard from uh, the, the Batman and Mr. Freeze set. And then I just built it on uh, two uh, 16 by 16 uh, plates that I had. I used a gray the dark bluish gray you see first because it has the driveway so for a uh, utility truck to drive in um, I can use any ones I have in my town and then I used a uh, 16 by 16 uh, light bluish gray uh, plate that I had uh, as the uh, place for uh, the power poles and the, and the generators to go. So I was I, I had been looking at this idea for a while and looking at YouTube and looking everywhere and just couldn't really find uh, a good Lego uh, power power plant, electrical plant, whatever, whichever way you want to call it. And then uh, I thought that uh, this would be a very good addition to my town. And uh, when I do my next city update, uh, you guys will be able to see exactly uh, where I put it. But uh, for now, just want to give you this overview. I'm just going to zoom in one more time and come across. And if anybody wants to part list or anything like that, just let me know. And like I said, two of the sets are just regular Lego sets from the Batman movie. And then I'll give you the parts list for uh, the additional pieces uh, that I added to add in the utility poles right there in the center. And then as well as the uh, generators in the back. So I hope you guys like it. Obviously feel free to leave me any feedback that you might have. But I thought it's a really good addition to my town. And like I said, my next, my next Lego City update, I'll show you where I put it. I'm working on rearranging a few things so that it looks good. Thanks for watching, guys.